Ferris then from the US, he's our lightest athlete in the entire field, 285 pounds. Yes, he doesn't even weigh one of the logs, which is quite extraordinary, and he's got to carry them, well, hopefully at high speed, if he drops it between the white lines, he doesn't make it to the safe zone, his go is over, that's it. Now, 12 metres for the first run, and then each one after this will be 10 metres, he just has to get the ends just over the white line, and my goodness, he's pushing it close there. He is, keeping them straight is crucial, can't let them clash, very difficult to recover from. Yes, it'll start to knock your legs about. That's Magnus Ver Magnussen, our four times world's strongest man winner, the head referee, watching on, making sure he makes the line. 32 metres so far. Gets down here safely, it'll be 42. Will he make it there? Yes, he will. Quick turnaround. Clock's ticking, though. 12 seconds left. He might just get one more run in if he makes it. Well, this is a good showing from Ferris. Pound for pound, this must be the strongest man in the world. He's extraordinary. Well, look at that. 52 metres then for Kevin Ferris. You know what, he's not even breathing that heavy either. That was impressive. Strength and fitness, what a combo. The former wrestler, this is the final run, picked it, ripped it and ran. 52 metres will be very hard to beat for the others. Certainly can be proud of that. We move on then to the Siberian force himself, Shivliakov. He's a great competitor, always fun, would look equally at home, world's strongest man or Street Fighter 2. <laughs> he's, he's a great guy, former Marine, of course, special services and just massive arms. Look at those guns. No problem lifting it up, he's got plenty of strength. He's now into his 40s. And that doesn't mean he's the oldest man here, of course, not with Mark Felix in the group. Well, just so physically strong, but mentally strong as well. Yeah, you, you put your finger on it there. Mentally, probably tougher than anyone else in the competition. He will not give up. He's told us how important it is for him to get into the final. He's only made the final once before, that was in 2015. Oh, charges it down the length again, but he's got a lot slower than what Ferris did. Just five seconds left. I have no coaches here this year, so no one telling him any instructions, and I think he may be... <laughs> oh! I believe that was his audition for the Olympic bobsleigh team. <laughs> he pretty much chucked that last one down and made it over the 42-metre mark. Good effort. Let's look at that final run again. Goodness me, the biceps are bulging, and he dives for the line. Yes, he did make it. Good call from Magnus Fair there. 